Today, we will talk about the definition, examples, and differences between affirmative and negative bond covenants. A bond covenant is a legally binding agreement between a bond issuer and a bondholder. It's designed to protect the interests of both parties. There are negative or restrictive covenants that forbid the issuer from certain activities, and positive or affirmative covenants that require the issuer to meet specific requirements. Covenants are put in place by lenders to protect themselves from borrowers defaulting on their obligations due to financial actions detrimental to themselves or the business. They're part of a bond's legal documentation, including restrictions on the issuer's ability to take on additional debt, requirements for audited financial statements, and limitations on the issuer's ability to make new capital investments. An affirmative or positive covenant requires the issuer to perform specific actions, such as maintaining adequate levels of insurance, furnishing audited financial statements, complying with applicable laws, and maintaining proper accounting books and credit ratings. A violation of an affirmative covenant ordinarily results in outright default. Negative or restrictive, bond covenants are put in place to make issuers refrain from certain actions that could result in the deterioration of their credit standing and ability to repay existing debt. Financial ratios that an issuing firm must maintain and interest coverage ratios are common forms of negative covenants. In one example, Hennepin County issued a bond and the debenture contained a covenant stipulating that the county can levy taxes to fund the debt service at 105% annually, providing strong coverage of the debt service. This is an example of a bond covenant in action. Here are four key takeaways. 1. A bond covenant sets out certain activities that must be undertaken, or what activities are forbidden, by a bond issuer. 2. Covenants are legally binding clauses, and if breached will trigger compensatory or other legal action. 3. Affirmative, positive, covenants are legal promises to engage in certain activities or meet certain benchmarks added to a financial contract that an issuer must follow. 4. Restrictive, negative, covenants instead restrict a company or issuer from engaging in certain actions. Hope this would help, thanks for watching.